Hello everyone, this is Ksenia Mia Bragilovsky out of my hotel room here in Markham, Ontario. It's June 13th, 2.30 in the afternoon. I just dialed in into online court of Ontario <clears throat> under the Zoom uh, meeting ID and the password provided. And uh, sure enough, the judge presiding over the matters of the day is uh, some dark uh, mother Atello, my ass, uh, who is clearly not equipped mentally, ethnically, uh, background-wise to lay judgment on any white female whatsoever, nor am I looking to be judged by individuals like that. So I've uh, excused myself out uh, right away after spotting a judge like that um, presiding over the matters uh, to be held um, okay I am I am now like I, I don't want to be exploited by so f some uh, freaking lawyers um, of Ontario or even Canada to exploit me to I don't know fill out their forms and uh, uh, procedures and I don't know what they do all day really again victim of human trafficking here I've been locked out of my house at 106 Montcalm Boulevard and I'm currently not um, um, given any sort of permanent uh, place to live in anywhere because uh, the keys are with the uh, York Regional Police and I'm not looking to be mocked and humiliated uh, at uh, one of their offices again. I am currently living out of hotels uh, and since January 31st that's my situation. And, uh, yeah, so that's my status quo again. Uh, I, 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 this is outreach to Interpol to take me out of this displacement camp. I am not uh, looking to uh, be employed ever again on Canadian soil or in United States because... First of all, I am not welcoming or accepting of a, a diverse mosaic situation, aka displacement camp situation, where everyone working with everyone. I am white female, and I am, I was, and I am a minority. I am not a white female American from U.S. or Canada, so I'm not gonna be harassed uh, uh, by this kind while working somewhere in a fucking clerical position. Nor am I looking to be. Uh, working with the uh, multiculturalism here, um, uh, immigrants from, I don't know, southeast, southwest, this, here and there, whatever. I do not belong anywhere. I want to be left alone. I've lost my hair. I've lost my sleep. I've lost 18 years of my life here on Canadian soil with your bogus housing, with your bogus employment, with your bogus immigration. And I'm currently being harassed by some chick on uh, uh, YouTube that's uh, um, advertising whatever AI learning. I'm going to post her picture uh, fully on my YouTube thumbnail for everyone to see the persons I don't want to see in my life, okay? Uh, so again, my situation is very much grievous. I do not accept uh, the multiculturalism. Um, the official policy of Canada. No, I do not. I do not speak French. And I am currently being denied social security because uh, my house uh, is under lock and key, nor am I looking to continue living there. But I absolutely want to have a permanent place to call home. And I don't want to be working with your multicultural environments, nor am I looking to be working with your all whites environments. Okay, I do not belong anywhere. And I very much want for Interpol to take a peek into my profile uh, at Mia Bragilovsky on YouTube and to take a look at my situation. My previous videos were uh, very much for uh, medical examination more than for um, public views. I'm documenting my daily life because I don't have any way out. Um, it seems I'm being sent uh, uh, into like some freaking displacement camp. I can't call it anything but a displacement camp. I want the fuck out of here. I want a normal living. I had property back home. I was a, a sin 
single child, like uh, um, the only child, that's the right word, the only child of two grown parents, okay, and by the my birthright, I should be able to have a property to call home, and if Canadian government cannot protect and secure my rights, I want for Interpol to step in and relocate me.